If you guys want to win more games, get innovative plays and updated game metas, then visit trythisplay.com and use code NOBLE at checkout for 10% off your purchases. Link is in the description. What's up today, my fellow man soldiers? So what I want to speak about right now is some things you should not be doing right now for several reasons. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. So what I want to do is I want to go to auction block and I want to show you guys something. It's better to show you guys than I actually say it. When I actually go to type. Okay. Oh, they actually got it now. Okay. They got it by position. See for a minute, you couldn't search by position or was that? No, no, no. I think you could. It was in your, in your item binding. You can't search for position anyways, but that ain't what I want to speak about. I just wanted to do that real quick. But I want to show you this specific player right here that I figured that is going for a ridiculous amount, which is Derrick Henry. I know some of you guys are looking at it as, you know, he's a good car, good player. Look, he got 86 speed. He got some other good stats. 82 acceleration, 77 agility, 82 carry, which is good. Change of direction and all that. But his brake tackle, his trucking is very, very good, right? He's a big He's a big halfback. Consider that he's 6'3". So he's a monster, right? So he'll do a lot of damage out there on the field. And I know right now because the game just dropped, if he's not the best halfback, he's the t one of the top halfbacks. Whatever the case may be, I know he's going for that much for a reason because people are actually going for him and they know that they're going to do some damage with that player, right? And then if you go for the... With the platinum one, it's gonna go for a lot more. So the reason I, the, the the thing I want to speak about it is, unless you're a Tennessee Titans fan or unless you really just want Derrick Henry on your squad because you just like him and you're gonna keep him for a while, then go ahead and get him and keep him in the squad. But then again, like I said, if if you don't want to lose coins, then that's another thing too. Like I said, if 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 you have to have him, like I, I'm 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 someone that has to have certain players on my squad right now even if i have to lose a hundred thousand or fifty thousand coins i want them right if you're that type of person then go ahead and get them but if you're the other person be like you know what? i ain't got that much coins i really do want derrick henry i'm just gonna go ahead and wait and mind you you don't have to wait that long because not only this not only do i believe that his price is gonna drop you guys might want the other halfback that's gonna come in the game which is saquon barkley right to me, he's going to be the best halfback in the game once he drops. Remember, the MVP promo is going to be dropping August 20th once the official game actually launches worldwide for everyone. So, I don't want people to lose. Remember, we're just in EA play right now. I don't want people to lose focus. Certain people are going to come up because they're selling. If I had this car right now, I'll sell it. No hesitation. I would sell it. Either quick sell it for the platinum or just sell it in the auction block if I had the regular car. That I'll, I would just straight up sell it because I already know in my strong opinion that he's gonna go down in value once the once saquon drop uh barkley drops on august 20th with the mvp promo coming out and also saquon barkley's gonna be the top halfback in the game so everyone's gonna be pursuing him i'm already gonna calculate that saquon barkley's probably gonna go for about 300k maybe 350 maybe a little bit lower depending on no, depend on what it is he may go for a little bit higher because he's gonna be the top halfback in the game but the thing is people are going to be more willing to spend their coins on saquon barkley than they are derrick henry right once again unless you're a tennessee time fan or a big derrick henry fan which is no it's not a problem then most likely you're probably going to keep them but i, I just want to let you guys know right now because i know some people like we're here what made me want to do this video is because I'm over here looking at the auction block. You know, I'm just looking around seeing prices. They actually got some decent prices when it comes to other players, other positions. I was like, okay, you know what? This is a lot fairer, especially since last year, you know, the way they're doing the prices and so forth. You know, it makes the prices drop a little bit. when it, The way they're doing certain sets, it makes the prices drop a little bit when it comes to certain players. So I was like, okay, that's pretty cool. Then I seen this player and then I was like, hold on here. That people forget that the 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 Saquon Barkley is actually gonna get a card. Are they really gonna spend this much for this card? Once again, this part this card is probably gonna go down in value. That's what I believe. He's gonna go down in value and Saquon Barkley. I know that for sure. Saquon Barkley is gonna be the top halfback, top halfback in the game once the MVP promo drops because that's just the way it goes as well as a lot of those other cards that they're going to release the mvp cards a lot of those cards are going to be good because they already come baked with x factors and abilities and so forth so imagine saquon barkley you don't even have to power him up decent speed 
X factors, abilities, and everything already baked into them, ready to go. Everyone's gonna be going after that card. They're gonna, and if they have a lot of, they're gonna have sets. They're gonna have solos. They're gonna have a lot of things where you're gonna actually earn players and stuff like that, so you can complete a set, maybe even get one for free. So that with there will make you think also when it comes to buying this player. For those who have them, go ahead and sell them. But like I said once again i wouldn't go too far into it and actually invest in derrick henry unless you pull him you want to use him real quick but i will hurry up and sell him because in my opinion he's going to go down in value saquon bark is going to be the top card and so forth another thing too i want to talk about is as is, is other cards that are going to probably go down in value as you can see right here, let's, let's just go real quick let's go to qb you already seen look at patrick mahomes is 90 96k right why is he so low is because a lot of people got him for free they got him for free with the pre-order edition what will i believe he'll go up he might go up a little bit once the regular edition standard edition drops and a lot of people weren't able to get to actually get the card he may go up a little bit i'm assuming but remember russell wilson is going to drop the in the mvp promo he's going to get a card either he, he's going to be, be be able to be powered up to a 90 or he's gonna get an 89 card or a higher card right so something like patrick mahomes tom brady and other stuff like that is not really worth investing in unless you just got them for free or you pulled them and you want to sell them whatever the case may be because russell wilson's gonna drop and he and he's gonna actually be the best card best quarterback in the game in my opinion with x factors and abilities already baked into the card so let's go see some other players let's see what else we got going on here yeah because i'm over here looking at these cards and i was like man so someone like aaron Rodgers, that well you can actually get his 80 i ain't gonna lie i'd rather just go and get his 85 overall and just use that and superstar ko if i'm gonna get that quarterback but to invest in any of these quarterbacks would be insane like i said because you're getting them for free in my opinion, you'd be better off going going for the, the theme builders, completing those sets, or you know, getting someone like Justin Fields. Someone just just hold you off for now. Or like say, for instance, if you, if you do want Russell Wilson, then go ahead and get his core elite because you know you can be able to power him up once the card once once his card drops, his MVP card, because you just might want you you just might be that person that likes powering up his card. Okay, so we're already at 85. Let's go, let's go over here. I want to show you guys this. Let's see how much uh, Saquon Barkley's card is going for. Got Alvin Kamara. It might be going for a lot based on the fact that. Yeah, see? So look at it. Check this. Saquon Barkley is going for 63K. Think about that. That is insane. This Antonio Gibson is how fast is he? Hmm, that's actually looking kind of nice. I think there might be another faster halfback that I might have to get. Is it Singletary? So he got 84 speed all right so i don't want to spend too much time looking at all these cards but the thing is is that i what i would do for now is get you like you know a decent little budget beast i got tony pollard i'm using right now just so you could use right now in order for you guys to complete the solos and so forth and wait for the mvp promo to drop because you never know you might end up getting saquon barkley for free or you might just you are you might just have to spend a little coins in order to get them because they're gonna have solos and everything else to get them right but like I said, if you do want Saquon Barkley, even though he's going for 65K, you better buy him right now because I'm telling you right now, once the card drop, this card might be even going for more because you know you got people out there that want to power him up, right? So that's what I got to say about that. I just wanted to drop the video because I wanted you guys to be smart about making decisions when it comes to investing your coins. In my opinion, Derrick Henry isn't the one to invest in as well as any of the any of the QBs right now. Unless you get them for free or whatever the case may be, do not invest in them because the MVP promo is going to drop around the corner and you want to save your coins because if you do want a, a top quarterback, you got it. Or you'd be like, you know what? I don't care for it. I'll go back and buy these other cards, which are, which are going to probably be a lot cheaper once the promo drops. So that's another thing. Don't invest in too much right now because once this promo drops, some of these cards are going to drop lower. You'll be able to buy for cheaper. Or if you don't want the cards, you'll be able to invest in a top a top halfback and a top a top uh, quarterback. But anyways, there it is there. I just want to let you guys know what not to be doing right now when it comes to certain players investing your coins and certain things right now. I didn't go into full detail. I just went into specific players because I seen that and I, I felt that I want you guys to know that. 
but I will be doing a lot more similar videos like this and always updating you guys because there's always new information all the time especially when the game drops when it comes to mud so there's things you got to be aware of so anyways I'm gonna leave it right here if you guys like seeing what you've seen drop a like if you guys need subs to the channel there will be more great amazing content coming your way thank you guys all for tuning in I'm out